back to you. All right, sticking together through it all, Ariana, thank you. This holiday season, a Douglasville family is sharing how they are overcoming unimaginable tragedy. They're in the hospital praying that their little girl will walk again after a devastating crash. 11 Alive's Angelina Salcido spoke with her mother about how she's recovering. A daughter's pain is a mother's heartbreak. A T-bone crash Saturday changed their life. When the car hit us, I didn't know what happened. Tina Stevenson thought she was dying in the driver's seat. Her daughter Brinley in the back on the passenger side. I got in the back seat and I said, Brinny, Brinny, stay with me, Brinny. Help couldn't come quick enough. Stevenson says they were almost home after the movie and took a left on Riverside Parkway in Douglasville. Everything went black. Both were rushed to Cobb Hospital. Brinley's injuries were so severe, she was transferred to Arthur Blank. I don't know if she's ever gonna fully move again. We don't know if, if and when she's coming home. We don't know if there's gonna be a full recovery. But her second youngest of four is resilient and there's hope. She can move her legs, so her legs are strong, so that's a blessing and the fact they keep trying to encourage me that the fact that she has feeling in her arms is a good sign. They won't forget this Thanksgiving. I made her smile today when I said, your brother wants to name a holiday after you. And she said, what? Today, more than ever, they're grateful. Life can change in an instant. What matters the most is that my baby's stomach rises and falls every day. Well, to see the mom and daughter there side by side in the hospital, that was Angelina Salcedo reporting right now.